Now, this week is set to see the hottest day on record. Yeah, but while the temperatures are going up, uh, do so do the amount of home burglaries. So what can you do if you want to protect your home, particularly if you're going away? Uh, and this is a man who definitely knows it from both sides. Former burglar Michael Fraser, now security expert. Always good to see you, Michael. And it is something that that people do worry about, don't they, when they're going away, thinking, I'm out of the house for two weeks, what are the kind of measures I can put in place to just make it harder for the burglars? Yeah, the, the, it's just quite simple, really. It, it's been sensible looking at your own property and imagining you haven't got the keys, how would you get in? Yeah. Because that's what the opportunity is that's doing. That's a really good point. You know, people yeah. say, oh, I got locked out, but I managed to get in through the bathroom window. And you go, yeah. well... well if you can do it. If you can do it, so can somebody yeah. else. But, but it is thinking like the yeah. burglar. So it's, it's quite simple. The more you do, the more he's likely to move on to the percentage. Yeah, if you, make, if you make it difficult. Here's the first thing I want to look at, right? These things are all the rage, and yeah. I've had examples of them. But the thing is, the selling point of these is you don't necessarily have to be at home. The burglar will think you're at home. Will they not get wise to that? No, they won't, because just like you could be in the bath, mm. you yes. could be anywhere, and you don't want to answer the door, so he's never going to know that. The problem is a, an opportunist is always looking for the least... Where, where you don't do any sort of security. They want the easiest way, he's, don't he's they? He's looking, if he sees this, he's going to think, hold on, these people think about security. How do these work? I'll tell you what's fascinating about these. I called uh, to someone's house the other day, and uh, as I do, as I do, you know, and I rang the bell a bit of reason, the person spoke to me uh, on this, and I'm expecting them to let me into the house, and they say, hold on, I'm three minutes away, I'm walking the dog. They were able to be on their mobile phone walking the dog, and yet I assumed that they were at home talking to me and seeing me yeah. through this. That's right. That's correct. You can be anywhere. Um, this actually will alert you as soon as someone moves near to the door. So, very good system, but common sense as well. Here, we have two locks. Yeah. Now, that is a cylinder lock. Yeah. If that's on, your door actually isn't locked. Yeah. If you do not engage this, which is a deadlock, I could tell that isn't engaged, because what the burglar does, put his foot up against the door... Push gently. ..and if he pushes it, Ooh. he can tell that lock isn't actually engaged. Mm -hmm. So don't have two locks and don't use them. Always yeah. use your second lock. I'll tell you something that really irritates me nowadays. A feature on a lot of modern doors is having an inside handle on the outside. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. That, in other words, if you were to accidentally close the door, you can let yourself in like this. Don't like it. I don't like it. Yeah. Um, just going back to Excuse the me, I video monitor, I just one, want sorry. to say, people are asking, how much are they? These, the, these are, well, the varying price, £170. Yeah. Very good, fantastic system. But, again, if I was coming up to this door and this was on the window, beware of the dog. Mm -hmm. Yes, would that scare you? No. <laughs> because if the dog can move around, so can the burglar. Oh, gotcha, yeah. So it means the alarm's not on or... That's okay. right. Any sensor that's on, it's not covering where the dog can go. So I, that wouldn't bother... Don't have the that time. Would be, fact, do you have wow, to dog them? Don't do it. Mm. Let's so, just the, the point Sorry. on these doors again, just going back to that, yeah. um, you would tend to buy a door that doesn't have one of the inside handles on the outside? No, I, uh, I wouldn't want a, a handle on no. it because it gives people more of a chance. Yeah. You're better with a deadlock. Now, letterbox... So, sorry, if I can just move you out of the way. We'll come round here. All oh, right. A cage on like the inside. Like what you did there. What it is, it stops letterbox fishing. People will push a pole through the letterbox, mm -hmm. straight over... Get your keys. ..over here, yeah. pick the keys up, and then they slide it like that, and it comes back but you can't do it if you've got a letterbox. Do you know, I always used to, when I heard dot. that, I used to think, no, they're not going to do that, and then that yeah, happened friends of ours and they stole the yeah. car. They will do. That's what they do. Don't put your keys just inside the door or handbags by the stairs. Take them upstairs. Yeah. Keep them out of the way. Because car burglars now scan, they use electronic devices to That's mimic correct. your remote if you leave it on a, a table yeah. in the front hall. Yeah. So don't do that either. No. So, okay. letterbox, very good. Uh, if we move over here... Simple item, like a timer. Yeah. Very simple. All you've got to do, set, a set your lamp, put it in, 
uh, set your lamp and that's it. It just comes and they're on. about 10 quid or something, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, £10, £11, pound, you'll get them from any do-it-yourself mm. shop. Very good and simple. So that's what would very you good. Have, would you do lamps, radio, lights, It wouldn't make lights. any difference. You can do a lamp, yeah. but try and keep it so they can't see where the lamp comes on. Yeah. So it could be in a hallway, you know, in a room, but obscure. As much as you can, obscure things. Was there something you said, don't hang a calendar? Yes. I never would have thought of this, but it's very... It makes a lot of sense. A lot of people put calendars up in their kitchen. Yeah. And the calendar's up with the dates on of when they're out. Yeah. And what they don't realise is the burglar can read. He will come <laughs> round the back, have a look through. If he sees that... And go, you're, oh, they're you're away not on there, holiday. He'll come back. Yeah. It's also a dead giveaway that you, you're not... Ho security mm. conscious so it's a great thing yeah we all have calendars don't leave them by windows where they can be seen and that's in the kitchen what about security cameras michael we've said the one on the door what about the ones you know that you see around saying cctv right this property this this to me is a fantastic system and i've got it myself what it does it picks you up as you're coming to the property it'll pick you up i can then I could be in South Africa and I could still... Yeah. It See it alert on me on my phone. It'll alert me and I can say, what are you doing? It's got a really good speaker on it. But it sends me a 10-second video as well of you. Okay. It will actually... And it's so clear at night... And that's day, £329. Yes. But money well really spent, that's going to stop To me, Michael, with this sort of thing, I think you. the advantage slightly comes back in the householder's favour with yes. technology. Yeah. I, I yes. love this because it's it's... A system that doesn't let you down. You can actually always... It, it buzzes to tell you, oh, someone's there on the okay. property. So, fantastic system. Cheers, Michael. Okay, we could you, go Michael. on for as long as the holidays are, but, um, you know, just be tips. aware of home security. Thank you very much indeed. Thank Appreciate you. that.